Amanda Gorman, the country's first ever National Youth Poet Laureate, made history again Sunday by becoming the first person to recite a poem during a Super Bowl pregame ceremony. According to the Rapidort Reporter, in order to invite Amanda Gorman to Super Bowl stage, the NFL had to spend a lots of money. It ranges from $700,000 to $1 million. So why does it have such a heavenly price? Gorman, a 22-year-old Harvard graduate who last month became the youngest person to write a poem for a presidential inauguration, used Sunday's stage at Raymond James Stadium to honor three honorary captains the NFL selected for the game. Today we honor our three captains, for their actions and impact in a time of uncertainty and need, Gorman began her poem. They've taken the lead, exceeding all expectations and limitations uplifting their communities and neighbors as leaders, healers and educators. Gorman recognized Tremaine Davis, a Los Angeles teacher, Susie Derner, a nurse from Tampa Bay and James Martin, a Marine veteran. Davis has made sure her students had internet access and laptops so they could continue their education during the pandemic. Derner, meanwhile, runs the COVID ICU at Tampa General Hospital, and Martin helped vets and their families stay in touch virtually with the Wounded Warrior Project. Let us walk with these warriors, charge on with these champions and carry forth the call of our captains, Gorman said in her poem. We celebrate them by acting with courage and compassion, by doing what is right and just, she continued. For while we honor them today, it is they, who every day honor us.